So let's talk about what you should expect from a coach or mentor. I gotta clean my board off. Okay, the first thing is, Buying leads, okay? It's not that simple. This is a question I get all the time. What kind of leads? Well, you want to work, you want to have a mixture, but you certainly want to be working fresh leads as fast as you can. Okay, fresh leads means you're gonna be you're gonna work less to set the same number of appointments. That makes sense. They haven't been called by anybody else, uh, or a very few at, at, at best. Um, they haven't been out there, they're they're fresh in terms of time, right? They're fairly new, you know, should be brand new, right? So it's a mixture. Uh, and then you want to work some of the older leads, right? Because it's a mixture uh, of fresh and maybe older leads. Whatever it takes to set the, the number of appointments that you want to have based on the income that you want to make per week, right? If you tell me, hey, I want to make you know, $8,000 a week, I can tell you how many appointments that you're going to need in order to generate $8,000 a week in sales. That's that relationship coach and mentor part I'm talking about that's so critical and important. So it's about buying leads. The next thing is teaching someone a proven phone script. Not just teaching it, but role playing it and working with you on the, on the objections. They should be there to help you after every phone session, right? Uh, to handle the objection you're getting because this is the number one skill in my opinion is learning how to convert leads into appointments. So being able to get handle the objections is number one. So they need to be available to you after every phone session, right? The other thing is, is having a time-tested and proven system that you can work and follow. Again, help with booking appointments. And what I mean by help with booking appointments is getting maybe medical information. So you can pre-qualify your prospect on the products before you go out. Then, you know, the next thing is product selection. Okay, the next thing is, uh, again, a time-tested and proven in-home presentation that works, that gets results, that gets your closing ratio up from maybe 30%, you know, to 90%, right? That's all about your in-home presentation, how you handle yourself in the home. The next thing is how to write applications. Okay, the next thing is getting your app, I said it before, from submission to commission. We're in this thing to make money, and if it's not paid out commission, that means the policy hasn't been issued. That means your clients are not protected, right? So uh, the next thing is, is that this is what we provide our agents is when they're in the home doing the, at the end of the in-home presentation or, the, or during it and they need help, they can 911-home to myself or Angela and we will help them while they're in the home answer any questions, run new rates, talk directly to the client, whatever. This is that coach and mentor stuff. Again, you, you can move from IMO to IMO to IMO to IMO. Really what you need is a coach or mentor that's going to be working with you, on, you know, to teach you certain things. Now, this coach and mentor will be, you know, will be around most likely forever. But certainly the first four to six weeks, this is critical to your success, right? So, you know, after four to six weeks, you may only need that coach and mentor for, uh, you know, infrequently, but they should always be there regardless. But certainly the first four to six weeks to get your, the cash flow of your business, to get you out there, get you writing apps and getting you paid is very, very successful. And they should be there working with you every day on every case before, after, or during the sale. That to me is the question most people should be asking is how do I interview my so-called IMO agent or the agency that I'm going to go work for is there's there's two decisions that you want to make one I is the IMO two is that coach and mentor that most likely you're going to be working with on a regular basis that can derail your success if not chosen correctly right so again that's the end of that video hopefully it helps and I really think it's uh, some valuable information hopefully you agree if you do hit the subscribe button below be a part of the channel make some comments uh, hit that, uh, mash that bell down there, and you'll get instant notifications of our live streams, right? Uh, and of course, we're building our own agency. If I can help, if you're looking to join an IMO, then certainly let's have that conversation. But uh, if you're looking to join an agency that uh, is hands-on and teaches you,
coaches you and mentors you to be successful, that's had 30 plus years in this business, give me a call, shoot me a text, uh, or send me an email, right? Uh, I can honestly tell you that we are quite different in how we operate day to day. Uh, if, you, if you're with another IMO and they won't release you, uh, you got to be careful about that because there's six months of two-year contracts uh, where they, for whatever reason, they'll handcuff you and not allow you to leave, which I don't understand. This is part of the business, unfortunately. Um, be a part of this channel. Make some comments below what you're struggling with and call me. It's not about recruiting. This is about helping every agent out there uh, succeed in this business. Certainly, we want to grow our agency, and if you're looking, give us a call. If you're somewhere else, like I said, and you can't leave, we want you to be part of this channel, and I want to help you succeed in the home. I get those calls all the time, um, and I'd love to talk to you. My contact information is below, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Don't forget Wednesday, our agent training series, and don't forget to share the video out and help somebody out that may be in this industry that's struggling like, uh, like many of the people are, right? Bye-bye now.